got to go somewhere and talk to somebody. That's your preparation for your blessing that's coming. We don't want to do these things sometimes. That's what the Lord says. He prepared Lazarus. Lazarus came out of that grave. He come walking. Even, even though he had those great clothes on, he came walking. I think I fell off of him once he got out there. Just like Peter. Like when we talked about last week, where the Lord told, him, told me, he says, so take notice, Martha. Take notice of the chains that were on Peter. He says, I didn't break those chains. He said, I didn't destroy those chains. This, this one this one has been on me for two weeks. He said, I didn't destroy those chains. I let them chains fall. I let them chains fall off of Peter that day. I let those chains fall so that everybody around him would know who done it. <laughs> so that everybody around them would know that it was God and God alone because the chains didn't break. That could have been man-made. That could have been something that happened because the man done it. Oh, they didn't just, they wouldn't destroy it. They go, like, the, like the Bible talks about the goat being destroyed. They were destroyed. The chains fail, Brenda. They fail. They fail. They fail at the beginning. And I just realized that. They fail. Those chains that was in front of them, the